bright beauty. Every student matters. Now, Swami's mother, he noticed, was not feeling well and had been lying on bed for two days and did not pay attention to Swami also. He saw that his mother was looking unwell and was not talking to him properly. And he talked about the same with his grandmother and his grandmother told Swami that he was going to have a baby brother soon. But this news did not make Swami any happy. Swami slept in his grandmother's room, listening to all the people, you know, moving around the house here and there. There was a female doctor who came to his mother's room and the granny asked, uh, you know, Swami asked his granny what was happening, but obviously he was not given with a direct answer. Swami felt very comfortable with his granny and did not worry about what was happening to his mother. In the school the next day, the class was not enjoying their lesson because they found it to be very boring. Swami sat next to the pea and told him about the birth of his new brother early that morning. Swami said that the baby brother who was born was hardly anything and he looked very funny. He also started laughing at what Swami had said and told Swami that once the baby will grow up, he would enjoy his company.